Hello there, my name is Ken Carson. I'm one of the owners here at Zybex, and today I'd like to talk to you about pricing for consoles in your control room. This is a pretty big range of price that you see in the whole marketplace. So I've seen consoles up there in that $40,000 range per console, and I've seen them down almost in that eight, $9,000 range. So what's the difference between a $40,000 and a $9,000 console? And the other question is, well, where do you guys come in for Zybex? So I'll get to that. On the high end, $40,000, what you're looking at is different philosophy fees from the companies and maybe something that you guys need. Some of these consoles are enormous. You're running 10 monitors. You're managing all kinds of stuff. So as it gets bigger, the cost goes up. So there's a start right there. So depending on the size of the station and your equipment makes a big difference in the price. The other one, the other one is the philosophy of the company that's selling it. What's most important to them? Is it just getting your margins? Um, is it built up in Canada where it costs a lot extra to build up there and get stuff shipped down to the United States? That adds just money to it no matter what. And then also, how are they set up? Are they going through a dealer? Are they going through a rep? Do they have a salesperson? Everyone wants to make their cut. And that's fine, we all need to make a living, but that can add to cost. So let me talk about the low end here and where you've got on the low end, and we can get a very simple small station you'll see out there in that 9,000 range. You can maybe go a little less if you don't do the height adjustable, but for me, that doesn't make sense. You gotta go at the height adjustable. Where Zybex likes to come in is we like to be in that middle in that sweet spot. We wanna be the best value for you. So where we see we come in, a range for a good control room console, let's say from about 12,000 on the low end up to about 20, maybe 25,000 at the top end. We can go higher than that we have, those are kind of outliers. So if you got any questions about pricing and what goes on in the industry in general, I'm here to help out, so hit me up. Thanks a lot.